It's rodeo time in the Hub City. The Texas Tech rodeo team is hosting its college rodeo starting tonight at Cook's Garage. That's always so much fun, and that's where we go live to Patricia Perry, who brings us a preview of tonight's events and what the team is aiming for. Patricia? Hey there, Karen and Abner. It's a great night for some rodeo here in Lubbock, Texas. The Texas Tech rodeo team is aiming high as they take on some of the best in college rodeo. Now, Coach Jared Hofstetter told me back in September that this team that he has this season is the best he's ever had in his time here at Texas Tech. But today he told me that it was off to a great start and then things got a little rocky. So he's hoping his Red Raiders can turn that around tonight and over the next two days. We started off really good and then we kind of went through a rough patch, but um, but we're really hoping to turn around this week at our hometown rodeo. Coach Hofstetter says the Red Raiders want it and are ready to compete. We just really want to win. We want our kids to go out and compete with the, you know, the best of their ability. Jacob Walters, who is a junior on the team, says he's had some highs and lows this season and he's going to give it his best at Cook's Garage. Just looking to kind of tap off this weekend and get on a roll. Competing against Texas Tech are Cowboys and Cowgirls from 16 teams in the Southwest region. Walters says it's some stiff competition. As far as college rodeo goes, this is going to be as good as it gets. This is your cream of the crop. Because he knows these colleges have some athletes that are ready for finals. The Southwest region, you know, between us and Tarleton and a few of the really salty junior colleges, you know, like we, we're known as the toughest region in the nation. Walters says everyone can expect a good performance at Cook's Garage through Saturday. And all the proceeds from money you spend on tickets goes right back to the team. That's how basically we operate for the whole year. Coach Hofstetter says he puts that money toward anything the team needs. We use it to pay for cattle, to feed cattle, to do repairs at the equestrian center. Uh, sometimes we use it for scholarship money. Walters says money for scholarships goes a long way because it helps these athletes continue in rodeo and be a student. We face a lot of expenses, not just our tuition and on-campus expenses, but you know we have to feed our animals though and pay and pay rent and all that other stuff. So it's it's a really big deal for us. The college rodeo kicks off tonight at 7.30 here at Cook's Garage in this beautiful arena. And then tomorrow night and Saturday night's performances will start at 6.30. Tickets are still for sale. They're $25 each. And remember, that money goes straight to the Texas Tech rodeo team. We have all the information and ways to buy tickets at kcbd.com. Karen and Abner, we'll send it back to you. Thank you, Patricia and Karen. When we were deciding who to send on this story, it was a no-brainer, right? Because Obviously. well, you wanted to go, didn't you? Well, because well, you have ridden, you know. I, oh well, thank you, yeah, Karen. Thank you. But no, no. Patricia, Patricia, was, <laughs> Patricia wanted over you. She wanted over you in a heartbeat. <laughs>